Hello friend, welcome back to Total Maintenance YouTube channel. You already know this 91 Toyota pickup truck, right? We did already some video on that. And this one has like 240,000 miles, right? It's absolute classic, I will say. And when I got it to the shop for inspection and I opened the hood, one of the things I saw was that the brake fluid was low. So I added it, right? It was also indicated in the dashboard that was that brake warning light. After I added fluid, the, wa uh, the warning light in the dashboard went off and everything seemed to be great. Obviously that brake fluid disappeared somewhere, right? Now I will show you where this older truck right 1991 already was equipped with the load sensing adjusting proportioning valve right and the bypass valve that's what's the name of it here you are looking at it and that's where unfortunately that brake fluid it's leaking from from the bottom of the valve right uh, unfortunately I'm saying because this valve it's expensive right I called the dealer and it's approximately 300 bucks and that's just the part we don't speak about replacement and adjusting it and so on right so basically what it says depending on the load which you put in the bed right that means how close this axle actually comes to the bed this whole thing needs to be adjusted correctly and this spring they call it spring in the factory manual starts pushing let me show it to you right it starts pushing on that valve right and that valve will adjust the pressure to the rear drums believe it or not that's what it does right so we have a leak sometimes people have a problem that the rear brakes will not break whatsoever because the valve failed now our problem is everything it's rusted here right and mostly it's the price 300 bucks for this plus the labor and so on as you can imagine you see the rust that might be a problem even taking it apart and there's not end of the problems right just to see right this is the flexible line which goes to the splitter and here it goes to the passenger drum well let's follow this line this line is still available cost unbelievable like 70 dollars and why am i bringing it up look what happened here somebody hit it so crazily i'm even not sure if the brake drum on the driver's side can work look how it's bent it was hit from the back right it should be here towards to me right look on the other side look at the difference and look what happened here so this is a nightmare yet believe it or not this line itself will cost like 70 dollars of course then it's a question if it's not easier to build it right you can build those lines but can you bend it correctly this way or will it be too much that's a good question so you never know right with these things it's good to inspect them because suddenly there is hmm, easily 600 dollars of repair here right which nobody had any idea that something's happening here that's too bad but that's the way it is so that was another interesting thing on this channel for you from my shop if you don't want to miss future videos make sure you are subscribed thanks for watching and have a great day my friend